It's a very exciting day to start our new footages of new uh, shows of social media marketing in our new studio, uh, Studio B. You know, everything is about growing. Like I was telling you before, we started in a very small lot, but now we are growing every other day. So we have a Studio B where we'll be filming videos on social media marketing so that at least we can grow together. As you're growing on your side, we're also growing together. And if you're new to our channel, our YouTube channel, or uh, please just hit that subscription button and hit the notification button as well so that you don't miss any video because every time we'll be giving you new videos and we will be giving you as well various tips that you cannot leave if you want to be a budding entrepreneur, especially on social media. So today we'll be speaking about how to establish yourself on social media, how to become the best in the game. So let's get started. The first thing is be specific. Being specific is one of the key things that you need to do if you want people to trust in you. Think of it. Have you ever seen several people who are selling this, they're selling that, they're selling that, they're selling this, so many things over and over that you cannot really explain who they are. They are selling mangoes, they are selling shoes, they are selling uh, real estate, they are selling uh, cars, they are selling... You, you wonder and ask them, dude, what exactly do you do? Because we don't understand you. You look like a con man. The same thing applies on social media. People want to deal with people who are specific on their niche. If you are a real estate entrepreneur. Become a real estate entrepreneur. Be specific. If you, you, you do other things like selling cars or doing other things, please create a different channel or a different uh, account for that. But don't mix things. Why am I saying don't mix things? It is very important for your client to gain, to gain trust in whatever you're doing. So if you're a real estate entrepreneur, you can even furthermore and say, I'm a real estate entrepreneur on Instagram, Instagram specifically, or Facebook or YouTube or whatever. But still, of course, if it is much more hassle, you can just uh, become a real estate entrepreneur on the three platforms or a car deal on the three platform or you sell laptops, and things like that and you're an influencer or something like that but be specific on one area you can become even a content creator you can say i'm not going to be an influencer i'll be a content creator i'll just create content for my clients on whatever area that they want some help you can become a facebook ads expert you can say, I don't want to be an influencer. I don't want to be a content creator. Uh, le creator. Let them bring the content. Let them bring the information. And then I'll do Facebook ads for them or YouTube ads for them or Instagram ads for them. Be specific. What exactly do you do? What, where is your strength? Where is your strength? That is a very, very important thing that can make you dominate and establish yourself well on social media. Number two. Establish an online present. Now, when I talk about establishing an online present, this is what exactly I mean. I mean, be consistent. Out of sight, out of mind. Every time that you're not consistent on whatever thing that you're doing, people will start uh, thinking that this person already maybe closes his business or things like that. How many times do you see uh, advertisement from Safaricom? All the time we're seeing Safaricom, 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 Safaricom. Here and there, we're seeing Coca-Cola left, right, and center so that they can always energize our minds and make us know that it's still happening. They're still there. Hey guys, we're still in the game. When you're driving, you see a banner somewhere. Hey guys, I'm still in the game. Whatever you're doing, whatever you're doing, you see text messages. Hey guys, we're still there. Coca-Cola is giving offers here and there. You see, be consistent. And your consistency as a person who is dealing, <clears throat> excuse me, um, who is dealing online is by posting regularly. Post today, post maybe after two days, post after three days. Don't post once in a year or once in six months or no at least every week have one or two videos that will be very much important to keep you 
staying there in the game so that you don't lose it. Number three, learn more and more on your niche. Learn more and more. Understand this, understand this, understand this. A client all that he wants is somebody who has a wider knowledge of what he or she is doing. Nobody wants to stay or do business with somebody who, let's say you're a video creator, you want to create videos for clients, but you, you basically don't even know how to do graphic design. And graphic designs, they are part of video production. So if there comes another, uh, another person who is giving the similar service to, to your client, but he has an extra art on graphic design, Trust you me, you'll be kicked out of the business. So you need to learn more and more. Every day as you sleep, refresh yourself, see something new. And nowadays, information is all over. On Google, on YouTube, on where, on Facebook, people are training others. You, you know, even the Bible says in the book of Daniel that in the last days, knowledge shall increase. I think these are the, the last days actually. Knowledge has increased so much that you can learn even how to, uh, to become a pilot from YouTube. Go and check it out. Everything is there. You can learn information. Gone are the days when you could only uh, think about school alone. There are so many people who have made it in life and they have never even stepped their foot in any college, any university. So please, learn more and more. Learn more and more. Show skills in your presentation. And the final thing is go professional. Who doesn't want to work with a professional? Who? Who doesn't work with a professional? Everybody wants a professional in their job. So this one I mean quality video production, audio production, scripts. Don't just do anything. Have a script. Plan your work. Be professional. Use good cameras. If, of, if the business is giving you money, why are you still sitting down there and you cannot invest in a good equipment? You cannot invest in a nice thing. Invest because everything that you invest on if it's in a business, it will always give you returns. So go professional, try and become professional. Let people see you on social media. This is a professional guy. That The same way I say to myself, every day I want to grow. I just don't want to stay where people have known me. No, I want to grow better and better. So thank you very much, guys. I hope this video has made some sense to you. If it has made some sense to you, just give it a thumbs up. You can like, you can comment, you can just subscribe to our channel and let us help us grow because I'm sure this one can really help someone. You can share to them and just tell somebody about our channel and I'm sure this will have done us a great favor by just spreading the word. And of course, you never know who you will touch with that message. Thank you and God bless you.